Alright, welcome in to another part of the Assassin's Creed Odyssey playthrough and, uh, well, the historical timeline of Assassin's Creed's playthrough. So, of course, we're going to Odyssey. Uh, hopefully, we'll be able to get this finished up pretty soon here. Um, yeah, it's uh, once again the Adventures of Cassandra and all that. I got, I'm got. i going to try and sneak up into that area up there because if I alert anybody, uh, it's going to be pretty well next to impossible to actually get into the place i, I need to get this proof on cleon's uh corruption and trying to get in there uh it just yeah it's impossible to search the place when you have 10 guards on you and the citizens are, are at your throw also so we're gonna try and sneak sneak up and in there without alerting anyone I don't know if I'm, I might be coming in sideways or the wrong way to this. Let's see. If I can possibly get through here without the guards alerting. Possibly. Again, I think I'm coming in on the wrong side. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm fairly certain. Yeah, I'm coming in on the wrong side. Hold on. I need to get around... The outside of this. I'm not trying anything. If I if I fast travel in to the sink point and then leap of faith it down, all the guards get alerted instantly. What we need to do is come in this way. Muddy tracks. There we go. Probably came from someone in the garden. For all my trouble, I'm stealing all their stuff. This shovel looks recently used. So to get the key, I need to find the commander Phylos. Great. Just great. Looks yes. like someone dug here. I can't steal it. Hmm. Very chesty clean on the garden, but it's law. Oh. It's the lock. Alright, so I gotta go find that guard. Maybe we don't walk straight to the city. Because it does tend to alert everyone. Maybe we take the scenic route around. The thing. So, uh,. I've been checking out a few documentaries on ancient Sparta and Greece and everything. Um, seeing Athens, seeing Sparta, and how, well, really how they both fell and, and all that. And uh, yeah, it's definitely, it's interesting seeing like, I'm pretty sure the, basically the Romans took, every, took both of them out. No, 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 no. But just to see that Sparta was the last one staying, but also the biggest downfall was themselves, in essence. Because they were so egotistical. And... Yes, and I just got the key. <laughs> it didn't say anything that I got the key, but I think I got the key right there. All right, so back to... We're going to backtrack again. Yep. And now they're going to be all on me. Hey, 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 hey. 
if, if you run through here, now they're all after you. Wait, if I get rid of the wall, I can steal that. Bingo. Nice. I could, I, I should, could and probably should just get out of here. Cause I got, I got what I need. Yeah, I mean, I, I would, I would maybe normally take them all out, but I need to get this done. They'll live to see another day. I'm a little bit behind schedule on, on how fast I wanted to get through Odyssey. We just had other things come up. As per usual. Yeah, so basically the reason why all this stuff was in ruin. Um, and, and pretty much, well, no, this is Athens, but... I guess Athens also kind of the same way is, is the, the Romans and the... Uh, not the Persians, but the Romans, I do believe, is the ones that came through and kind of sacked the city and destroyed everything. Really unfortunate for everybody in the future, but of course they didn't care. Come through. Who's he want? Oh, wait, no, wrong arrow. There he is. Good, you're here. Excuse me. You are waiting for me to speak. You should be able to use this to your advantage. It's what I could find about Cleon. She's got way too many veins and shit. Many places that he wants to wipe out. With the sway he has over the police, he'd get the votes for death every time. Then it's up to us, right now, to change their minds. So you'll join Topical. me. Talking sure. to the people may not be enough. We need to show them why following Cleon is wrong. I'm, I'm surprised going to, to hear destroy you suggest that such an idea. <laughs> Desperate times. Isn't right. that what you said? So I did. Follow my lead and respond as if you're one of Cleon's supporters, not mine. I'll do my best. <laughs> but Socrates, Cleon is a man of the people. Tell me, if you harm someone with a sword, are you not responsible? I am. What if you hired someone else to harm another? Are you still responsible for that harm? That's ridiculous. I'm not harming the person, someone else is. Would the person not have been <laughs> safe from harm otherwise? From me, at least, yes. Then you admit you bear responsibility for that harm, for you have still participated in it, even if indirectly. I suppose I do. We have agreed that we may harm another, even if not by our own hands. That's right. So let me ask you another question. Who should you trust? The many or the one who has more expertise? Oh, everything in me is like, what the, well, thanks. A lot of time to crouch and be manipulated though. That's it, it just, uh, they both have the goods and their bads, the pros and the cons. I follow the one with expertise. Surely they know better than I do. Then your decision is based only on what another says. It's all I have to go off of. And if they <laughs> lied? People who lie to me don't deserve my trust. Nor should they. After all, if someone lies to you a single time, what's to say they would not do so again? Yes, you're right. So you agree that someone who lies to you is not worthy of leading? Of course. Oh, Athenians, would you not also agree that you can have responsibility for harming another even through someone else? I would. 
And would you follow someone <laughs> you found out had lied to you for their own gain? Of course not. Above all things, therefore, I beg and implore you, hear these words. The one you currently follow is lying for his own gain. Cleon has lied to you in order to get the votes needed to attack Mytilini. And we have the proof that he'll do it again. Should the ship arrive in Mytilini, the people stand no chance of surviving. Now that you know the truth, you can take back your decision. Another vote must be called. The lives of those people are in your hands too. <laughs> the ship must be stopped. Yes! <laughs> That was a great display of rhetoric. The people will be unable to deny what they heard. All we did was talk. What we did was far more. We used proof and clear argument to bring forth an outcome that will not just hurt Cleon, but hopefully save countless lives. But was it enough? I believe word of Cleon's misdeeds will be shared throughout Athens. <laughs> its citizens it's love an episode of YouTube debating. <laughs> Nobody wishes for it to fall. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> And the crowd goes wild. Woo! Okay. More mercs. All the mercs. I could actually take that one out. I gaped the enraged. You look very young. Uh, I have to kill like a teen. They're too young to die. Uh, okay, so. Get rid of this stuff. Get rid of this stuff. Get rid of this stuff. No goals. Jeez. your assens again why is everyone in the guarded areas can't get to you if you're in the guard areas where's the door hero roll it's over here I'm back. <laughs> so, what's next? The play was a great success, as I knew it would be. With that and the proof you presented at the Phoenix, Cleon has lost much of his popularity. Now he heads <laughs> to Amphipolis in an effort to redeem himself. Cassandra! Hey, Prasida sent me oh, to find sorry. you. He's alive and well. Where is he now? Amphipolis. They're preparing for battle. If you reach him before I do, tell him I'm on the way. So what are you going to do? Hmm. Ooh. You can always get Cleon later. Wait. Didn't I watch him get stabbed? He got taken out by, by Alexios. Brasidas needs my help. I plan on giving it to him. Though should our paths cross, I won't hesitate to kill Cleon. Whatever you decide, remember he's only a man. I can't promise anything. Be safe. 
We can use all the allies we can get, so. We'll help them out. We will rise. <laughs> uh, okay, so the next, where is it? Here. Up north. Uh, oh, further up north. Way up north. Top of the map up north. Holy shit. Hmm. I thought that was just for a DLC area up there. Okay. Right now I gotta make my way back up top. Uh, if we're gonna go fight in a war or whatever, I'm gonna have to switch up outfits real quick. Surprise! <laughs> it looks like we're gonna probably have to fight in a war. Hold on, let's go do some inventory checks. Okay, I think I'm looking pretty cool now. Probably the most covered up that Cassandra's been all place through. You got my message. I heard about Pilos. Are you alright? I've been through worse. We have bigger problems right now. This is our chance, Brasidas. We kill Cleon today. If you don't, then I will. But oh, I'm gonna. There's something you're not telling me. <sighs> I am here for Cleon. Let's keep it at that. I thought we were friends. You're not who I thought you were. You were raised Spartan. You should know how to be loyal. Hmm. Yes. I did what I thought was right. You hurt my reputation. I can fix that, Brasidas. Let me fix it. We're wasting time. Athens is gathering reinforcements. I... We need to attack now. Let's go. Malaka. Mm -hmm. And this is Spartans, the Sparta's biggest downfall. No giving up. They're too busy, you know, trying to make a name for themselves. They didn't repopulate. They didn't make the right choices. Here comes the politics and such. They need to be shut down now. Exactly, is about okay. So we're here. I guess we got. Oh, okay. Yeah, the battlefield must be over here, and we got. It well, looks like the battlefield. We going this way. I see us. Where the fuck are we going? The Athenian camp is ahead. Okay, Destroy let's go. All. I'm trying to do. Rah! Into battle. Ow!
Everybody needs to do a war cry. Awooga! Stuff on. Give me that shield. Ah, oh, shit. Alexios part two. Demos. Damn it, you're dead again. Now he's really dead. Alexios is definitely not dead. He's he's a demigod or whatever. I, I hate that. Like basically, we, we just look at it like, yeah, you're, he's a superhero. Instead of being just like a regular dude, that's it. Cassandra, come now. Show mercy. You turned him against us. My own brother. We lifted Themos up. We made him great, unstoppable. You made him a monster. Ooh. <laughs> then fight by his side. Teach him. You would have Themos once again. His name is Alexios. I beg you, this world is severed, Cassandra, and will unite it. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> My hands are empty. Have pity. Ooh. You will die just as you lived. As a coward. I'm not through. I won't be forgotten for all I've done. You're 
not worth the memory. Popped him into a mud punch. There we go. That's it, man. Irini will want to know Cleon is dead. And Vrasidas. I should have gotten to Dimo sooner. I'm sorry, my friend. Picking back acids. This is a work workshop located northwest of Pandora's Cove. Malice offers unique services. Visit this location to learn, to learn about new engraving tiers. Really, I don't remember that popping up before. And Demos is gone. Sometimes something if you're still sitting there. Ooh, level 42! Yeah! And he's definitely gone. Just a few more... A few more main story quests. And then we got the DLC and then this this whole playthrough is done. But let's fly back. Oh, right. I got the cultist is gone. The main one of them all. We're almost there. The ghost of Cosmos. I can do all my abilities. Yeah, first thing we'll do is rank up the health pack. Godly power. Um, yeah, so now every single one of these abilities is going to be going into putting all these to level threes. Uh, I am actually thinking about doing the ooh, bow chart speed. That's actually good. Um, I am actually thinking about doing that's a soul version of that. Eh. Um, the platinum trophy for this. I've never done the platinum platinum trophy. Actually, this is the first time I've actually played through this on uh, the PS5 or on the PlayStation, I should say. At all, because if the the first time I played through it was on the PC version, so I can mod it. But I don't really like the way Cassandra looks overall, like like the veins and the and, and the bow wounds and everything. I'm, I'm like, eh. Um, there's some very, very cool mods that people have done to make uh, both the outfits look better on this uh, and more realistic to to ancient Greece because uh, they, they do kind of cover up a lot more than what they should be. Like they always have that underdress on Cassandra. It's like, nah, she should, should be more loose than that. Where is it right here? Well, I guess we're going back home. This is, yeah, okay, back to Sparta. Back to Sparta, and then we got run up the hillside. Ancient Sparta. You found this? Giddy up. <laughs> Giddy up. Road back home, where it all began. This is one of the things on the PC that you can mod is uh, the horse will actually run. You just get up and then the horse gets going. But you would, you would. Up the home, ramp the road back home. Holy shit, this is a long ways. Mount Olympus? I don't think they have Mount Olympus um, like on here, labeled on here. Let me get the horse back.
Yeah. On the hillside overlooking Sparta. Oh, you can see the cloud coverage a little bit. That's cool. Again, everything about this is like they are gods. And when we get back to like Altair and Ezio, they're just regular guys. They're just regular people that are, that are trying to figure out how to take down the Templars. My lamb. You've been gone so long. Brasidas is dead. No. Vimos killed him in battle. And what of my son? Hmm. Cleon fired an arrow into Vimos's back. The wound didn't look fatal. He could still be alive. Malakas, Cleon. I'll kill him with my bare hands. It's done, Mother. <laughs> I already right. sent that snake to the sticks. My family. You're all I have left. Mother, there's something I need to do. I need to go to Mount Taietos, where it all began. My whole life has been spent fighting and running. Running from my past, fighting to forget. I can't do this anymore. My heart was shattered on that mountain. I need to put that night behind me, once and for all. I'm coming with you. Here we go. No, yeah, I, I, yeah, I, I do remember what's going to happen. I won't say anything, but yeah, this is going to be a Good part coming up. Uh, can I save? If I can save, that'd be awesome. Yeah, because there's a couple different ways that this can go, possibly. We will see. I I'm, I kind of want to test some stuff out. I never got. I never actually tested it out on the first play. I was like, I'll do it the second play through. And now I'm like in a rush to get through it again. Game's just a long ass game. Yes. This is where everything changed. It's like I never left. Alexios! On the edge of the world, a mother calls out to her child. Touching. Alexios, please. You use that name as if it means something to me. It's the name your father and I gave you. Was that before or after you brought me to this mountain to die? It was the cult. I tried to save you. I did everything. Mm -hmm. The priest told me you were dead. And they told me you abandoned your son. Alexios. Come to me. We are your family. We can go home. Oh, boy. Family. Home. <laughs> my sword is my family. The battlefield is my home. I told you, Mother. He's too far gone. Too far gone? Is that what you told Mother? Why didn't you tell her the truth? And what truth is that? That I'm the chosen one. I'm the one with a destiny. I will bring order to this world. Oh boy. You're nothing but a mercenary with a broken spear. Hmm. If you say you don't need the cult, then he's going to be like, yeah, because I'm above the cult. If you say the cult is using you, then he's all like, no, I am not the Delu Luru. <laughs> I just realized it's bronze and then gold there on the bottom. Ah, my outfit. I almost had it correct. You don't have a destiny. You are just a tool used by the cult.
I'm glad you said that. Since we first met, I've been trying to figure out what you are to me. You're a weed, trying to choke and destroy everything I've planted. And you know the best way mm -hmm. to kill a weed? He's gone. Is that their word? Alexios? When I was little, I found a lion cub trapped in a snare. My friend tried to free it. That's when I heard the deadly growl of its mother. I watched as the lioness tore my friend to bloody shreds. Even in the world of beasts, a family protects its young! I loved you! I still love you. The one you love is dead. My destiny is clear. And I won't let you get in my way. Mm -hmm. uh. And again, like the as uh, how hmm. I don't think there's multiple ways that this can actually go. But, uh... Alexios? Listen to me. You are my brother. I tried to protect you once, and I failed. I will not fail again. The bitter ending. This belonged to our grandfather. Hmm. Don't trust what if the terrible things. We all have Alexios. Wait, we can save him? Really? Oh, on my first place where I killed the shit out of him. Okay, that's a better ending, I guess. Hmm. Didn't know you could actually save him. I thought he was just gone, gone. Okay. Interesting. I really got to change that outfit. <laughs>
I should have kept a Wonder Woman outfit on. Damn it. Demigod. Belt and the sword. Demigod's chest plate. Ah, well, maybe actually a Demigod's chest plate. All right. Good ending. Uh, shit. <laughs> Um, fire damage was this one adrenaline warrior adrenaline. Yeah, yeah, pretty good. Pretty good. I really don't care for the look of the sword. It kind of looks weird. We're going to go in, in prep for uh, Sasuke Chow's. We'll, we'll stick with the uh, Katana. Uh, finally got some decent bracers. Yeah. Woo. Warrior damage, all damage. Good stuff. Those are actually pretty good. Um, that's, uh, let's see here. It makes her look like a dude. I don't know about that. It's good stats. It kind of makes her look like a dude. That's got the boob armor on, you know? So you gotta, you gotta add the boob armor. <laughs> yeah, I think, I think I kind of like that overall. I mean, I mean, this one's probably still one of the best ones, except for the shoulder part. If they could, if I could get rid of the shoulder piece off from there, like modify it just slightly to get that shoulders gear off. It just, it looks kind of tacky, the shoulder gear, but everything else looks pretty good on that. I feel like they did that just because it's, it's almost too much like oh if there's just a did that too much skin oh my god, oh my god. And that kind of works with it it kind of really works with it although the other one has way more gold on it though just saying just saying man. this one's more more gold looking and it looks like a championship belt which i do like that but the the gold pinstripe though, mm, okay, maybe, okay, maybe, 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 maybe. Uh, I still the sandals, man. The sandals, it just looks stupid on the battlefield. You want to have boots. The sand, you lose a toe on the battlefield if you have sandals on. Really well, great. The ghost is a liar. Okay. Do we have, uh, I'm definitely not going to get this cultist stuff done, uh, right now. I think we're actually, uh, yeah, I think I'm pretty much done with the main story. And Alexios is supposed to be, yeah, she looks pretty cool like that. But Alexios was like the, the main one. A dinner for the ages. The family's all back together. Wow. I was missing half of these characters Sometimes on the first place here. Sometimes the face we show to the world <laughs> needs to be one of strength, despite the chaos we harbor beneath. There's more to being the best than pure strength. That's an excuse for the weak. I'll show you who's weak. Well, at least the family is all together. Mm -hmm. I'll get more wine. This is definitely Sparta. <laughs> well, that wasn't so bad, was it? I can't believe I have a family again. The gods work in mysterious ways. You never know what they have planned. <laughs> I don't think the gods can take credit for this one, Barnabas. An urn is only as strong as its potter, Cassandra. Urns are pretty easy to break. Just remember, no matter who <laughs> surrounds you, I'll be there. And the I'll others be are there. waiting for us on the ship. Right behind you. Yes, Carl, my name. 
Oh, he's in. So there we it. There we have it. That is the end of. Yep, that's New Game Plus. So, I mean, it's not credits rolling, but that is the end of the main story. So. The next part up will be going through the DLC to show the bloodline lineage of Cassandra and uh and any epilogue stuff all right so one of the final parts of the assassin's creed odyssey played through we are going to jump in on this and uh yeah it's basically the epilogue and the other episodes of the first blade dlc which is you know the um Kind of like the epilogue story of Cassandra and everything that pushes along the bloodline of the Assassin's Creed lineage. So, um, we are pretty well. Of course, um, we are pretty well done with this. I'm gonna try and wrap it up with this part, with this uh, finale of the series, hopefully. Let's go over and talk with Socrates. Behold, I've kept myself alive. It was the one job I gave you, Socrates. <laughs> I knew you could handle it. I would have attempted it even if you hadn't told me to. It's not as easy as it seems, staying alive. There's not many of us left. Then let's pay tribute to them. Though they aren't here now, they were here once. Come with me. My opinion on death is a nebulous one because I know nothing about it. Therefore, I know I shouldn't be afraid. I'm not afraid either. Many are because they don't know what death holds for them. <laughs> one can only trust that the gods know for certain. It's kind of funny, Cassandra. You can play this as Cassandra does not believe in the gods, even though she is technically one of them. Think wisely, although no one can truly know anything. Think wisely, although no one can truly know anything. her like a child with the intent to protect her you were not only her friend but her guardian thank you for giving her the burial she deserved there are countless others here in elysium the blessed have earned that eternal happiness one of them is our great pericles athens owes him a debt for all he's done they didn't call him the first citizen of athens for nothing a man of many contributions but also a private man if only he had shared his burden. We only knew him as he presented himself to be, but who's to say that wasn't his true self? This war has taken so many. Even Brasidas fell. Maybe so, but as a Spartan, he fulfilled his duty and died on the battlefield. Mm -hmm. I could have helped him more. He was on my side. Your mm -hmm. survival avenges him. You can't he help will everyone. Be as a hero. The people will remember how we brought down Cleon. Apparently, soldiers found Cleon on the beach. A casualty of war, perhaps? Couldn't say. <laughs> it's hard to recall what happens in the heat of battle. Either way, let him spend his eternity in Tartarus for what he has done. And be certain, our friends wait for us in the light. I drink to that. Hmm. Who am I to say no? Almost a slight bit of the uh, the creed in there. Knock in. I am definitely very tempted to uh, to platinum this out. Um, 
it's not hard to do and the amount of hours I've sunk into this game I feel like it's kind of earned it in a way <laughs> well this has supplied me with plenty of new material for my next play remember how Cassandra took the monger to task for all of Corinth to see that would shoot a drama there's been no love scene yet let me provide that inspiration now. Beauty is short-lived. You may as well use it, Alcibiades. And to that, I raise my drink. He has a lot of knowledge. <laughs> to Athens. And our promise to return the city to its former glory. A tribute as good as your singing. And to the gods. Now, dear teacher, I think you should whisk me away for our private lesson. I'm afraid I haven't had enough wine for that, Alcabiadis. Then someone fill his cup. <laughs> right. Is there another cutscene, or are we we back in the free room? Yeah. Everybody's drunk. Oof. Okay, so next stop would be to go towards the DLC of. Let's see. Not doing that. Uh, 22 fragments, which basically would be taking out the rest of the cult. Uh, let's see. Legacy of the First Blade, so I'm thinking, yeah, so a lot of this stuff too. Um, Find talks to the contact, mentioned he would be weighing in. Yeah, he is weighing for a vantage point in the small town western okay shall from the east shall heritage 